Okay, I'm at 1930 Diamondback Drive. This is the front of the house. The house has a two-car garage. The pool's on the side. The property goes across the wash, and down the driveway there's a little storage unit I'll show you in a minute. There's a side yard over there. I'm going to walk through the front entry. you got a little courtyard here. has saltillo tile. This is the step down living room. I was saying that maybe you could have that filled in so it's not such a step down. This is down the hallway towards the bedrooms. Bedrooms are all on one side. This is the first guest bedroom. The windows have been replaced. This is just linen storage, guest bathroom. The second guest bedroom. I'm going to go across the hall to the master bedroom. It does have double closet. And this is the master bath. I'm going to walk back down the hall towards the great room. It's got a nice fireplace. It has a gas fireplace. I'm going to step back. This is the laundry room. It's kind of oversized. You get room for craft tables or other thing. It's got storage niche there and little built-in desk area. Kitchen, a really cool turquoise countertops. She's in the process of painting these cabinets. Big nice corner sink. Stainless appliances. This is going to be your dining room area. And it goes out. There's a nice covered back porch. This is fenced. I have to send the parcel map to see if there's enough room for Bruce to build a shop right here. I think you can cut in a road to access it. But this would probably be the best location to build a shop would be right here next to the house nice covered back patio we'll walk in and go look at the pool Nice play pool with two gazebos. And this is fully fenced, so it's secure.